Hey cute people, it's me with an update. Just want to let you guys know I am now sitting in hot north khaki lacky as they call it. But it is hot here, I'll tell you for sure. I just came outside because I wanted to do a little update, let you guys know what's going on with me because you haven't heard from me in a very long time. So I just wanted to make this video and make it really quick because it's hot out here. And in my mother's house, of course, it's very nice and cool, but her house is darker than my apartment was. I can get some light in, but I can't get really comfortable so I can make this updated video. Well, like I said, I'm in North Carolina. I'll be here for some time. I'm no longer, I guess, a New Yorker. I'm a North Carolinian. Oh, my goodness. I just can't believe that. But I'm here with my family. And that's the best part of it because I haven't seen them in quite some time. My youngest son went to stay with my oldest son. So he's in Georgia. So you won't hear that snooting that he used to do every now and then in my videos. I'm holding this camera by my, well, I'm holding it with my hand, so it may move around. You may not see my whole head. Maybe you just see my eyes. I don't know. But just listen to the words that are coming out my mouth. I'm still using my handy-dandy Kodak camera, which I love because it gives me the best um, results. So I'm using that. But I just want to say I don't know how or when I'll do anything related to beauty because like I said my mother's my mother's home is dark her bathroom doesn't have a window to bring in any type of light I'm in the back of the house I'm on the porch and um yeah but I think I may I was just telling my mother I may vlog a little more than do anything related to beauty because the light is not really good. I really couldn't find any place to really get comfortable here. I've been here now about a week, as a matter of fact, yeah, a week. And I have been wanting to do this video. I wanted to do something while I was on my way down. I took Greyhound down here. Greyhound down here, yeah. The bus. I was going to take the train, but it was a little costly, and I bought the ticket, you know, last minute. So I took the bus, which wasn't that bad, but it was horrible. So, like I mentioned, I am going to be around my family. Just wanted to update you guys. And I hope to be able to do this um, a little, well, not too long from now to, you know, to get back to you guys. Because I'm going to miss doing anything as far as beauty. I haven't been on YouTube in quite some time. And um, I'm sure you guys can understand because I had to um, make some arrangements right away. And, you know, my life is going to be a little different for a while. How long, I don't know. But I will say because I enjoy YouTube, I will be here to let you know how it's changing, how I'm progressing, and um, where my life is going. But I'm around family, so that's the most important thing. The most important thing. I would have to say, I can't say that I'm going to enjoy <laughs> being here in North Carolina as opposed to New York because I was born in New York, raised in New York, and had intended to die in New York. And this is really different because here in the part of North Carolina my mother lives in, you need a car to go anywhere. You need a car to go everywhere. There's nothing close by. You can't w wake up and just say, I'm going to go here or there unless you live in New Bern, which is the city part of the area, I guess, where my mom lives, I guess you'd call it. But, um... Yeah, so in New York, you know, I can just jump on a bus, jump on a train. I didn't have to worry about parking. And here you don't either because everyone has their own driveway and such. But I'm going to get my license. I had my license before, North Carolina license, because it was so easy to get as opposed to New York. So I'm going to get a license. I really can't say I want to buy a car because that's an added, exp added expense. But... Um, I just may do that. But I think what I'm going to do, because um, I can't stay away from YouTube, and since I'm around my family, so I have more people who I can engage with me, so to speak, 
I think I'll probably do more vlogging videos as opposed to the beauty videos and reviews and such only because I don't have the best light to do that and I'm not um, in a position to buy lights and so forth and such but then again you never know things might change but yeah, this is just an updated video to let you guys know what's going on with me. I've noticed that I have um, some people who have been subscribing to me since um, I've been gone. I greatly appreciate that. And I definitely have to say that I hope I can give you guys what you're looking for. But like I said, it'll probably be more vlogging videos because um, I can do that. And you can do that anywhere. And let me just say, um, the other day, I wanted to bring my camera. I didn't. I went to um, Walmart, which Walmart in New York, I wasn't close to. Remember, I didn't drive, so I didn't go to Walmart often. Also, in Jacksonville, if you guys know where that is, I went to Ulta. And I've never been in the Ulta. There's an Ulta in New York, but it's not close to me. So I'd have to get on a train, da da da, which I never did. And um, yeah, I'm near one. So the next time I go, I'm going to take you because I'll have more time to look around and you can see my excitement because same thing with Target. Even if we have to drive to those places, it's not like I was telling my mother if I wanted to buy something from Target or Walmart, I have to get on the train or the bus. And what if I wanted to buy something big ticket? I mean, how would I get it home? I'm so cheap. I can't see myself paying um, a taxi for a taxi. But now um, I have access to a vehicle to drive. My mom, she goes to Newburn quite often. So, ta da. And like I said, I'm just enjoying myself trying to stay out of this heat because it is so hot here in North Carolina. And I really hope that I am showing you guys me. But like I said, I'm just sitting on the back porch chilling. And this is what I'm looking at. It's so nice, quiet, and serene. I'm glad it cooled off. But this is what I'm looking at now. Yeah, like I said, I'm sitting on the porch. That's my nephew's vehicle. My mom's vehicle is over there. That's her shit. <laughs> and all that to walk around and to warm. You see some... Um, Fill, well, the fill back there, that's something um, going, I'm not really sure. And we'll come around here. I mean, it's nothing like having your own grass backyard, a place where you can just sit and chill. Nothing like it, right? But this is it. I just wish there were more trees, but I believe there's some shade over there. You can sit and um, not be so hot. But yes, because it's hot here in North Carolina, I tell you. So, that's me. And like I said, what I'm going to do, what I most likely will be doing is more vlogging. And I think that'll be fun. And, um, yeah, this is me in the South. I'm trying to think if there was anything else I wanted to tell you guys, but being as that I'll be doing a little more talking than reviewing or, hey, that was it I wanted to mention. Oh, my goodness, I never, ever got started with my hairstyle challenge because... It just didn't work out. I'm kind of disappointed because I really was looking forward to doing a little something. And I wanted to do 30 hairstyles by the time summer ended. Whatever the last day of summer was going to be, that was when I was supposed to have completed the 30 hairstyles. But it's not going to work. And if I can do it while I'm here or something similar <laughs> I'll try it but the next thing I wanted to mention someone had asked me to do an empties video and I had all the empties together I'm not sure what happened to them I wanted to try to do that before I made the move and then I wanted to do the um, product stash video but I didn't get a chance to do that either so yeah but just bear with me as I get things back to normal for myself, whatever that may be. 
and just know that I'm here in North Carolina. So give me a shout out if you're in North Carolina. Let me know what town you live in. Perhaps you have family here. And um, what do you guys do other than if you work and go to school? I got that. But, like, um, man, if you want to do something, you just got to drive. Like, you know another thing that ticked me off? My um, computer, my Apple computer. I was supposed to have tried to get that fixed before I came down here, which I have wanted to see what I could do to get it fixed because I didn't think it would be as easy to do while I got down here. And it sure isn't. Now, you know, in New York, there's an Apple store where there's at least five or six in New York City. Manhattan alone. Manhattan alone. So now here I am in New York. The nearest Mac store to where I am now is in Raleigh. That's 100 miles away from here. So what could that be? Maybe about three-hour drive one way? Ah, oh, you do not know. Oh, my goodness. I think I also tried to search to see where the nearest Mac store was. Um, I think I'm still waiting for that information. Sephora, the same thing. I was so surprised that I saw an Ulta, which I hadn't gotten a chance to search for. But Ulta may be about, mm, I'll say maybe a 20, 35 minute drive from here. So it's not too bad, but it's not like you say, I just want to go, you know, beauty product shopping. You have to really be going for a particular reason, such as I have $100 to spend and um, I'm going to spend it all in Ulta. Yeah, because I can't see you just going just to be going. But... Who knows, who knows, who knows. So I'm going to have to get used to things like that. Like I said, you know, you want to just get up and go. You just get up and go. Whether you have a car or not, you just get on the bus and train and you're there. Now here, no bus, no train. I don't know if they have taxis, but maybe you could find a taxi. But most likely you have a car or someone will take you. So I have to get used to that. And then, let's see what else I could mention to you guys. Anything else that I need to tell you? Well, that's pretty much about it right now, I'll say. And if you were wondering what I have on my lips, and only because I have it in my pocket, I'll show you guys. I have, um, I just felt like red today. One of my nephews told me, you're always wearing red. You and grandma always wearing red. This is, um... Riri Wu. Yeah. So I put that on today to give my face and my lips some vibrancy. Yeah. So I am going to end this video now. And I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Hopefully I'll see you in the next. And I want you guys to share and spread love.